So how'd you find out about the, the announcement of the Peach Bowl? Were you actually watching the no, TV? No, I don't think any of my teammates is watching. Um, just woke up and uh, looked at my phone and somebody tagged me in the post and so I kept, we got Bama. Is that what you expected? Had you guys been paying attention to the rankings beforehand? I mean, it's hard not to when everybody's talking about it. And, uh, you know, I get asked that pretty much every day. But, I mean, we pay attention to a little bit because, you know, we want, we want to know, compete against the best and actually get a chance to play for the national championship. So, as far as that, we, we uh, you know, we pay attention to it. But as far as, like, every day checking our status, that's not really our thing. So, how much film have you watched of them so far? Uh, pretty much every game. And what do you think? Do they have weaknesses? Yeah, they do. I mean, every team does. They're pretty good. What, well, just what they do, what they do well, is really simple, but they do it well. Other than that, they got a lot of good athletes and great coaches. So. Is it strange that Coach Tosh and Coach Sark are a part of that staff now? No, not at all. What was your reaction when you heard Sark got promoted there as offensive coordinator? Congratulations. Pretty cool, man. Have much contact with him? No, that's not. This time last year, Keyshawn, you guys were preparing for the Heart of Dallas Bowl, and this year now you're preparing for a national championship semifinal. Yep. Does it have a different feel to it at all? No, I mean, it definitely does. You know, it's like we accomplished you know, our goal so far, and, uh, you know, definitely we got a little bit left to do. You know, we're just focusing on that. Um, our goal is you know, to show out here and show who we was, and if doing that, we're going to win a lot of games. So we won a lot of games, you know, we're still on the journey, so we're just focused on just – Focus on the next week and just keep getting better. Can you talk at all about Azeem's role in this now since he got hurt? And yeah. I know he still wants to obviously be a part of this and whatnot. What has he been able to do? Um, for him, he just pretty much just get himself healthy. You know, just get himself healthy and just get himself back into shape. And as far as that, doing treatments and just being there, just in guys' ears, making sure everybody's doing their job. As far as now, I mean, he just, he's just another guy just like just coaching the other guy up. Do you, do you guys feel like underdogs right now going into this game against that team? Uh, no, nah, not really. I mean, as far as like who, like what other people were saying. Yeah. You know, I, I think somebody tweeted me and said, you know, I'm a, I'm a UW fan. You know, I'm a root for you guys, but you know, when it comes down to game time, I mean, we know it's gonna happen. So I'm like, wow. you're not really a fan, so you can mess with that. <laughs> um, but not, not really. You know, we're competitors. You know, the only thing we're focused on is competing. So a lot of guys have, are, when, like a lot of fans, you know, hold up signs at college game day. We want Bama. Mm -hmm. Do you guys feel that way? Or you like, do you want to play them? Would you want to play against the best? Well, my, I thought Miles had a great quote yesterday. He yeah. said, you know, the national championship goes through Alabama, and everyone in college football knows that. Yeah. Hey, we want to play against the best. A lot of the doubts maybe that some people have about this team trace back to the USC game where you guys didn't play your best that day. Yeah. Why are you better now to – why are you better equipped now to sort of handle a team with, you know, elite talent like, like that and like Alabama has? Well, one thing that's like when you experience success, when you, when you experience a fallback like that or a loss – I mean, that's one thing you never want to really feel again. Yeah. So that's pretty much just make everybody work harder, focusing on more on the details, and pretty much just hone into what you really got to do. Um, I know going into that week, they game plan really well against us. And as far as now, like, everybody has this period in time where they're game planning and doing the best thing they can. So we just focus on just what we messed throughout the season, fixing that, and just, just going forward into our game plan. Uh, 